Hi, Jerry Springer here. Would you like a personalized holiday message from me? Well, thanks to friends at Nosy, we're gonna be sending out 12 such personalized messages. And if you'd like a chance to be one of the 12 to get this Springer stocking stuffer, uh, then just click on this video or the link below. Tell us to whom you'd like the personalized message sent and the best reasons for wishing them a happy holiday. Have a very happy holiday. Today on Spring. Don't take your boot off. Huh? <laughs> Taiwan has got a score to settle with Shannon. She's sleeping with my man, Jerry, okay? If she's engaged to him, what's he living with me? Sleeping with <laughs> She's fighting to win back her man. Hey, 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 your story's done. Okay. Lauren wants to confront Colleen, but who's this person? That's my best friend, Donnie, and thank you very much. They're here to say, I'll never let you go. I used to drink a lot. Now, see it. <laughs> Today on Spring. Hey, welcome to the show. My guests today, my guests today are here to demand their ex-lovers come back to them. But that's not all. They're also here to confront the women they say stole their man. Hey, please meet, please meet Taiwana. She says her fiance is living with another woman, even though they're supposed to get married in three weeks. Taiwana, tell me about well, Jerry, this girl is a super slutty-ass bitch. And I'm telling you, she's sleeping with my man. I'm the one that's been with him for three years. I'm the one that's got his baby. And she's gonna let him go before this show ends today. <laughs> All right, here, here is this other woman who uh, right now she says is, uh, and you admit, is living with your fiance. That's right. Here's Shannon. What the you know about me? You know thing about me. Have a, seat. Have, a, have a seat. They're nice chairs. Um, <clears throat> what are you doing? No, don't take your boot off. Huh? <laughs> This is the only show where you gotta check your shoes. <laughs> All right. Uh, she's saying that they're engaged. They're supposed to be married in three weeks. What are you doing living with him? If she's engaged to him, what's he living with me? Sleeping oh. Hold on, wait a second. Taiwana, stay seated for a second. I don't understand why you're angry at her. Your argument is with your fiance, not with her. If he wants to be with her, why are you angry at her? What you do? I mean, she got so much to say about me. 
me when I'm not around. What but is I want to hear you her say? say it now. What do you, what do you, what do you? I've never said nothing about yes, her. Yes, she did. You're lying ass, stupid bitch. Hey, 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 hey. She paid somebody to come to my house. Yes, no. Why are you yelling my name? <laughs> Hold on. St okay, for a moment, stop attacking her. Uh, this, okay, here's the story as I understand it. This fiance of yours, this guy who has fathered your baby, you've been together for three years, he apparently is making a decision that he wants to be with her, at least he's living with her now. I can't understand why you're so angry at her when she she's just staying there. Jerry, this guy's coming here. With my man. But but he's not. That's... I don't care what he do. Is the point that stupid whore sleeping Why with my she? man? You know she doesn't have a relationship with you. Hold on. Shh. She doesn't have a relationship with you. She doesn't owe you anything. He does, but she doesn't. <laughs> no. That's all I'm saying. I'm not saying you shouldn't be upset or you shouldn't be angry, Jerry, but I'm I don't upset. know what she did I'm wrong. I'm upset because she got so much mouth to talk about me and behind my back, but she can't talk in my face. It's hard to because you got a fist in her face all the time. <laughs> and it's going to stay in her face. Okay, okay. I better be standing back here when I I'm mean, talking. I mean, she's, stop, she's stopping <laughs> him from Why seeing his I... daughter. No, okay, I'm she's just... She's stopping him from seeing his daughter. Okay, I'll tell you what. Let's take a break, and when we come back, we'll meet this guy. Stay with us. Wait, is it six Today we're talking to women who want to demand their baby's fathers come back to them. Um, okay, let's see now. We were talking with Taiwana first. Taiwana is, has been with uh, this fella, Krishan, for three years. They have a child together. They are uh, supposed, they're engaged. They're supposed to be married in three weeks. There's a complication. Even though they're supposed to be married in three weeks, Krishan is in fact living with Shannon. And, uh, so I gotta, we all got to find out, what is Krishan thinking? Engaged to one woman, living with another, the wedding three weeks away. Here is Krishan. <laughs> hey, okay. <laughs> Krishan, welcome to the show. You got to admit it, it's a strange story here. You have a child with Tawana. You're, you've, been, you've known her for three years. She says you're supposed to get married in three weeks, and yet you're living with Shannon? What are you doing? It ain't like that type of party. I don't know what the hell she's talking you about. You know what the hell I'm talking about. You can run your mouth all you want to, you hear me? You know what the hell I'm talking about. I'm gonna run my mouth. 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 All you do is bring your sorry ass over TV, and you go and embarrass. You die. You're going okay. to? You can run all you want to. You can run all you, you want to. You want to do what you want to. chopping your damn heads right yeah, off. Yeah, the only way you're going to take me home, only way your sorry ass going to take me home is you got to pack ain't me in a body bag. Ain't nobody sorry you about you because I'm the yeah. man that you are ever but be. You don't have me, do you? Whatever, I do have you? to have you. Huh? I don't have do to. Do you have me? Okay, well, hold on. Why, why does she think, okay, hold on, one second. Why does she think you're getting married in three weeks? At some point, you must have said, I love you very much. Thank Let's you, get Jerry, married. Thank you, Jerry, because he did. <laughs> Tell me you why she thinks this. Better tricks on her. I used to drink a lot. Now, sit. <laughs> Did 
did tell her that she was going to get married at some point, didn't you? She crazy as hell. Yes, he did. Yes, he did. Okay, Jared. Okay. Look. Jared, he denies even being with her for the simple fact. He called How me telling he deny me being with that you, girl, shut the hell up, Trent. Okay? Trent, I got your trip. You want your back? You want your back? What the hell? Hey, Trent, I got your trip. You want your back? What you got? What you got? All right, hold on. She's a trick, like I said. You win, too. What you got for me? You take it out. This is a romantic moment. It's been like, me and her have been together like almost seven months. Yeah, right, yeah, We right. had our ups and downs and everything else. But it ain't no black and white thing. It ain't nothing like it's that. It sure ain't. It's just Cause straight Because I take love. a white man any day over you. <laughs> take it. Take it. Go ahead, take it. Take the white man. Go ahead, take it. If I have I don't it. want your sorry ass. You can forget that. Ain't you. you can forget that. Ain't you can cancel that. You, you can cancel everything. You've been sorry all your damn life. I ain't gonna be, I ain't gonna be yeah. sorry when I do this. I'll tell you that. <laughs> Let's meet Sean. Oh, you want to see four? Welcome back. I know you don't love it. Don't even try. And uh, you I won't used to be get a player married. and everything else, but I ain't no player no a more. A bitch to bitch. You won't be married. I was playing her too. She wasn't that. Yeah, you're playing her too. I want to ask you. But you never did me? play me. You trick. <laughs> Can you marry me? Oh uh, yeah, right. I don't give a damn, cause um, I got plenty men, honey. <laughs> Loves you. Okay. Now I want you to meet Lauren. She is four months pregnant and says her baby's father's new lover is trying to destroy her life. Uh, tell me about that, Lauren. Hey, Jerry. Uh, <laughs> hey, how you doing? Good. Uh, what's going on? She is such a bitch. Let me just tell you about this girl. Girl, gotta come out here and get her ass beat. That's what's gonna happen. Well, wait a you second. know what? This girl, she calls. She calls my house and threatens to kill my baby. My baby can't defend itself. It ain't even born yet. She calls and harasses my mother, all right? You don't harass someone's mother. Forget that. You don't harass somebody's mother, all right? Okay. Forget that. I don't care who you are. You don't harass okay. someone's mother. Okay. But 
I understand you're angry at this. Uh, uh, how long have you been with your boyfriend? I was with him for seven and a half months. A month. And is he now with her? Yes. Why, why, do, why do you care to be with him any more than if he's leaving you for her? Because you, you don't... Shh. Go ahead. You don't... Hell up, bitch. Oh. 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 <laughs> you know what? Shh. Okay, go ahead. You, you know, you don't fall in and out of love that quickly. It doesn't happen that way. But you could never really trust him, could you? No, I couldn't, but I still love him. And, you know, I want him back, but I don't want what he's become, what she's made him. Yeah. I want who I had before back. And he was a good man then. I don't know what she did. What do you think? I wouldn't That's lie nice. if it yeah. wasn't true. No, I, yeah. <laughs> okay, but you don't want to get too much in a fight here because you're pregnant. That's right, but I got my girls here. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that's great. Only on our show do we provide stormtroopers. Um, look, hold on. Uh, so why are you angry at her? Because she doesn't have a relationship no, with you. Why are you see, angry at her? If she calls my home. She calls your home. She calls my home. She has her friends call my house. Why is she harassing you, do you think? I don't know. Maybe, I don't know why. Maybe, know? I, maybe I have something of his that she can't have. Could be. That's the same with her. See? I got so you do she ain't got. Uh -oh. That's oh right, baby. I take care of my so you care. really do get running around living on welfare. Uh, I ain't on welfare, oh, baby. Yeah. I'm hey, a manager. You guys are done. Open up the store. Shh. Hey, hey, hey. Your story's done. Let's bring out Colleen. Okay, hold on. Oh, all right, Miss Brain Damage. Someone must hate you real bad. I'll chase your ass out and drag you 50 feet, you oh. But at least I have no. the reason why Sit I talk the way. Sit down. Oh, it's not. No. Oh, it's not. Oh, yeah, keep smiling. Because who did he last night? Hey, hey, hey. Hey, nice language. Uh, okay, hold on. First of all, you shouldn't be hitting her. She's pregnant. So I don't exactly. give Exactly. Why should you want to fight someone? I agree. She's, she's pregnant. Yeah, you shouldn't be either. Think of your baby. Forget her. Think of your baby. Exactly. See the in my life. Stand your life? Do I call you? Do I call Excuse his, me? Do I go to his house? Do I go to your house? No. Just come to my house. Exactly. And what happened when we went to your house? I said, Bruce, who do you want? And who did he leave with? Uh, look, we're gonna we're gonna take a break. When we come back, we're gonna meet this guy. Stay with us. Woo! No, 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 no. no, this won't stir. Hi, Jerry Springer here. Would you like a personalized holiday message from me? Well, thanks to friends at Nosy, we're gonna be sending out 12 such personalized messages. And if you'd like a chance to be one of the 12 to get this Springer stocking stuffer, uh, then just click on this video or the link below. Tell us to whom you'd like the personalized message sent and the best reasons for wishing them a happy holiday. Have a very happy holiday. Welcome back. Um, Ex-lovers uh, are apparently interfering in current relationships. In some of these cases, he's, uh, the ex-lover is either pregnant or um, has had a baby. Um, 
with an old boyfriend, and that's what we're dealing with now. We have been talking first with Lauren. Lauren is four, four and a half months pregnant. Four uh, months. Bruce is the father of Lauren's baby-to-be, but in the meantime, Bruce is now living with Colleen. And let's find out how Bruce manages all of this. Here is Bruce. No, this won't stir. Okay, first of all, who was that? That was my best friend, Donnie, and thank you very much. Okay. Oh. All right, here's my question. Okay, Bruce, but who Bruce, is he let's talk to Bruce. Home with? That's all I have to say. Oh. Hey, hey. Thank you. Shh. Hey, hey, stop. Thank it. you. Okay, is she coming on? <laughs> Hey, you know, I think, why don't we just all join hands? <laughs> okay, hold on. Bruce, let me just talk to Bruce. Hold on for a second. Everyone stay in your seat calmly. Bruce, what the hell are you doing? You got, you got her pregnant. Now you're living with Colleen? No, I'm not living with her. You're not living going with her. Oh. He was living with her. Okay. Did you, when you impregnated Lauren, did you love her? At the time, I said I did. What happened in that relationship? It just wasn't working. It wasn't working. And then she told me, after we broke up, she told me that she was pregnant. Oh, okay. I didn't I'm, find I'm out until after. OK, all right, all right. So it's my baby. Because my best friend was sleeping over your house a couple of times. You said you didn't do nothing. I don't know, I don't know that. Excuse me. Your friend slept over my house where I sleep with my mother and where he sleep with Kimberly. I don't know that. Yeah, he was sleeping with him because I went there. Now one you're morning, Lauren's friends. What's your name, Dottie Ann? Dottie Ann. Nice to see you, Dottie nice Ann. Nice to see you, Jerry. Yeah, this is a better way to come on the show. <laughs> um, what is your interest in this? You're Lauren's friend. You're up. I'm Lauren's best friend. Best friend. Okay, and I don't like Colleen for what she's done for Lauren. She calls Lauren all the time, telling Lauren, "Oh, where's Bruce?" or, or uh, her and Bruce are happy or Bruce or got whatever. stabbed. Or Bruce, Lies. Yeah. And then, and then Colleen comes to Lauren's house and stuff, starts problems. And then Lauren, no. No, 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 no. Oh, oh, when we went there, we, we, we both said her. nothing, no, nothing to get started. No, you tried we getting We both said that. That's why she got in my face. That's why she got in my face. You called that night. You called that night. Colleen. Yeah, the bitch was put on us. So what's wrong? Stop! 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 Colleen, 
Hold on. Okay. Uh, Colleen, what do you want to say to Bruce? You tell her to stay out of our lives. If you don't, oh well, then you can go home with us. The yeah, only way it's gonna end for me is Bruce. I don't want you no more. That's the end of it. I don't need you. Watch get it. Away, go, get away. Colleen told you this so many times. Well, wait a second. A Hold choice, on. Bruce. Bruce, you're saying you don't want Lauren anymore. Yes. And now, Colleen, you're saying you don't want Bruce? No, because I'm not going to live my life like this. You should have left. You should have left it alone. Okay. Right? There you go. Hey, Bruce, maybe we'll fix you up with Tawana. Okay. Next, this man. All right, I'm just joking. Sorry. Next, this man says he's here to beg the mother of his child to take him back, but what he doesn't know is she is now pregnant by his former friend. Oh. We'll meet them all when we return. Stay with us. guests who want another chance at winning their ex-lovers back. Please meet Dave. He says the mother of his child left him five months ago and he's been suffering ever since. Uh, oh, you're also sympathetic. Uh, Dave, what's going on? Um, well, basically I've been together with her almost six years. With who? Uh, Lisa. Lisa, okay. And uh, I was in love with her enough to be willing to spend the rest of my life with her, never even thinking about another woman. And Aww. so I gave her a child, and we were going to have a family, and we were going to get married. Then one day, I found out she cheated on me. Aww. And then I found out about 80% of the reason I fell in love with her was all a lie. Aww. Sick thing is, I still love her because she's the mother of my child, OK? Do you think? Do you think you could ever that you could ever trust her? I mean, even if she came back to you, it would take uh, a full confession on network television to get me to forgive her. Yes. What better place? All right. Okay. Well, so you love her. You want her back. She's the mother of your child, but she's now with someone else. I'm going to give you a chance to make your plea to her. Here is okay, your... Well, I'm, not, I'm not finished yet. i got to let you know something real quick. Ooh. Hey, this is your show. That she left with, okay? I never... I was probably out of work maybe two months and six years when I was fending for my family. She left with the pissant mother... I'm not going to say the word. <laughs> who can't hold a job, never had his own place. Pardon my French. <laughs> you weren't gonna it's about the ugliest little p ever met in my life, all right? This guy's got nothing going for him, okay? I love her to death. This guy wanted to get laid. Did you? Okay? Did you know? Period. Did you know that, do you know this guy, or did you know this guy? Yeah, he was almost my best friend at the time. I was letting him stay at my house. All right, well, let's bring, I'll tell you what, you can make your plea to your girlfriend of six years. Uh, here is Lisa. You know Am that? I? Yes, Am you I? are. Why don't you fill me in for the first time in my life? Why I don't you tell me the truth? All right? I left because you're not the yourself. 
Mm -hmm. Why don't you talk about you I breaking never, my ribs? Did I ever Give me say a I was eye, innocent? Huh? Did I ever say I was innocent about anything? Maybe you want to put me on the spot then. Let's go. Yeah, I left you because I was unhappy with you. You did nothing. You laid in there and you played Nintendo. You never even watched Excuse your me? child. You 70, never carry your child. 75 hours yeah. a week I work yeah. and you bitch about me coming home and Yeah, right. What about your kid? Girl, what about my kid? I spent more time with yeah, you You were lying, so. You came home, went to sleep in the back room. Did you realize I've lost 25 pounds and it's been six months yeah, because dude, yeah, That's why. Why would you do that to me? Nose. Lisa, you know what? You're lying sack. Lying sack. I love you so much. But it doesn't look like you two want to be back together again. Check it out. Well, you know what? I'm going to say no something way. to her. You know what? I'm going to say something to her. And if she does not mellow out, then I don't want to be with her. I don't ever want to You know what? I didn't appreciate what I had until I lost it. You know what? Okay? I was working so hard for you yeah, two that right. I lost sight of what was yeah, what going on. Three months, you didn't even do nothing but play Nintendo. Hey, you know why? It's because you had cheated on me two and a half years before that, Lisa, yeah, and I knew right. it was over. Mm -hmm. So I was just killing time. Did you ever love me? Kid. Yeah. What about, what about my kid? kid? Did you ever what love him, Lisa? Kid? I took Hold my on. Kid Hello. Hey, hey. You ever love her? You love him? Long time ago, not anymore. A long time ago. Why did it Girl, stop? Girl, you never loved me to do to me what you did to me. You All right. It. You took my daughter from me. For a All right, now you're with now you're with Sean. Oh yes. Let's meet Sean. Oh, you want to see? Oh, because I want to talk instead of yell. Yeah, right. I left all those messages. <laughs> I left all those messages in the storage bin because I was told, you'll see your kid tomorrow. And it was 30 days before I ever heard from you again. It was about 30 days. 30 days. I told you. I you told you. Don't, don't worry that. about it. Because what I do, he's going to die. But now, all right. Sit. You have to sit. I don't want to get hurt. <laughs> Sean, do you realize losing my daughter? You didn't lose your daughter. I can see her. Oh, please, get all you went right over to the store. You lied, sir. I've been by the phone for bill. six months Half waiting bill. for my daughter to call. Yeah, call. My birthday, we show her birthday, birthday Christmas. You lied. I got to let you see her. Dave, for six months. Dave, waiting for you guys to call. Dave, oh, we called. Dave, Dave. you called. You called. You called. Thirty days. Dave, Dave, Dave. 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 I can't on. believe the Shh. I'm hearing okay, you, Jerry. Dave. Shh. Yeah, I can't either. Jerry. Okay. One question. There we go. One question. Just one question. I want to ask you. I understand. Everyone else, be quiet. I understand. Right now, oh, oh, not right now. You don't love him anymore. No. But you had a child together, okay? Yeah. So what about being a him being able to see? Your child. What about that? I don't want him to see her. Because he left. Hold on. If he's the father, anytime he sees her, I don't have nothing to do with her. You're lucky. You're lucky he was a poor excuse The issue isn't him and his daughter. The issue is he wants Every, her back. Her. And he's not getting her back. I did not he want did her back. Okay, we'll be right Why? back. Stay with you two.
questions. Here's questions. Here's questions. I have a question for Tawana. How, um, you say he hasn't seen a baby in six months. How are y'all gonna get married in three weeks? Well, see, that's the thing. No, 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 no. See, no, see, he was away. Okay, that's the thing. He was away. That's why he ain't seen her. Because he always stay away. And you know what I mean, where he's been. He never stayed away from me. Oh, that's because he ain't got her. Oh, no, let me not say it. Let me not say it. Let me not say it. Um, this is for Lauren and Bruce. Bruce, what are you going to do now, now that she's left you and you say you don't want her and I love your guys' accents? Oh, my <laughs> God. One more person says that. <laughs> what are well, you going to do now? the baby's born, I want to work out, like, vegetation rights. I I really? Him, really? You know what though? A month ago it was I don't want nothing to do with my baby. Then Friday it was oh I'm not with Colleen no more. Uh, he someone sure. talk <laughs> out his mouth. He sure ain't right? seeing my baby. Someone talk oh, out his mouth. Never knowing. <laughs> but he will be taking care of it. I yeah, said that. <laughs> This, this question is for Lauren. Are you getting um, together with him? Because I saw you was comforting him and stuff. Yeah. <laughs> what? What? I, I missed that whole Baby, thing. Baby, we all She's comforting asking. him, okay? Excuse we me. all. He's a real man. Okay. He's a real man. Okay. He's no, a real no, no, man. Let me tell you something. Okay. I've been sitting here for two months waiting for this one to acknowledge it even has a child when this one's waiting for six months. <laughs> I got a steady job. Now you do for the first time in your life, you piece of Taking care of our daughter. Yeah. You bet. Oh my God, Lisa. Oh my God. I ever fell over the piece of like you. Go to hell. Denim shirt. Um, if you didn't propose to her, how the heck did she get that in her head that you guys were gonna get married? She just imagined it. Let's hear his answer. I was talking to her on the phone. She kept asking me about it. I didn't, I didn't ask. Tell her. Hey, hey. How, how am I gonna marry her? And she's talking about she got all this stuff. Don't I gotta get uh, sized up too if I'm gonna get married? Jerry, he Donor? was supposed to come down and get sized up. He told his mother. His mother asked him where he was going. He told his mother, "I'm going to tear a house." Okay? This girl called my mother's house. She gave me her, his mother number. That's why I called her. Okay, okay, yeah, we right. got the answer. Okay, okay. okay. shh. Yeah, All right. Yeah. For you and the purple, I forgot name. Shannon. Shannon. Shannon, what makes you think that he's not going to do the same thing to you that he did to her? He's going to be a how he ran game on her. He'll do the same thing to you. And another few months from now, you're going to be she's in talking about all this oh, to you. Okay. Rob get you a hero. <laughs> Drop the zero gets you a Thank hero. Thank you. Wait a minute. He's at the bottom what? line. Shh. Because he's got a real woman now. That's why. Oh, Jerry, Or the young man in the plaid in the center. Yeah. What are you going to do now that she says she doesn't want you? Are you going to try and get her back, or are you just going to let her go? Yeah, I love her. I mean... <laughs> You don't know either. Whatever! Yeah. You want to get snapped again, bitch? Okay. Come on. Uh, on that pleasant note, we'll take a break and I'll be back with the final four.
Let me take this opportunity to thank all of you for being with us. And uh, I know there's been some pain here, but I hope you're able to move on with your new relationships and find happiness with someone else. Uh, you know, it's hard to let go, particularly when you've so given of yourself, when there was something so special between the two of you. But when it's over, it's over. And being angry or jealous or just plain sad doesn't justify screwing up the life of your ex. The vengeance may offer a momentary rush, but more likely it will just keep you mired in the pain and bad feelings of the breakup. And if you think, well, if I just keep on him, he'll come back, the more you meddle in his new relationship, the more resentment he'll feel, and the likelihood of a reunification will disappear altogether. No, it's time to move on. If it didn't work out, there was a reason. And the truth is, there is someone out there, if you give it a chance, who will love you more, and who you will love more, without the baggage, and you'll wonder why you got so bent out of shape over your ex in the first place. If someone truly doesn't want to be with you, the truth is, you really don't want to be with them. Till next time, take care of yourself and each other. Jerry, I'm all the way from Philadelphia. You're my hero. You tell it like it is. Good luck. Jerry, my friend and I, we travel from Bloomington, Illinois, to fulfill our civil responsibility. That's performing a little Jerry duty. Hi, Jerry. Hi, Jerry. I love you. I love you. I love you. Hi, Jerry. I'm Janice. And, that, and I'm Steve, and this is Adrian, and he's bound to be a guest on your next show. So next time you have a show on transsexual Satan worshipers <laughs> who want to be Jehovah's Witnesses, he's your man. Thanks. If you think that was wild and crazy, then click here to keep watching. And don't forget to subscribe. All you have to do is click here. And one more thing, take care of yourself and each other.